Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Daughter of Increase. My name is Nate Denise. For those of you who are new to the channel or who just happen to stumble across this video, and I post new videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, all about my faith, God, Christ, and expanding the kingdom of God. So, as the title says below and above, or wherever you see the title at, this is going to be my two minute, two minute sort of book review of Star of Persia by Miss Jill Eileen Smith. So, I do have a book look tutorial coming on this makeup look. This was basically where I, it's basically a series that I'm doing where I take book covers and translate them into makeup looks. So, you guys can see I did do this purple and gold look, and I really, really like the way it looks. I do. I am wearing my brooch from Kay's Brooches. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know I have been raving about these brooches. It's Brooch Boutique, and um, she does go to my church, and she has phenomenal brooches. I'm going to do a whole collection video, but there's this elephant, and let me get closer. I just thought it was cute, and it really went with the whole vibe that I was feeling right now, so that's what we did. But um, let's talk about it. So if you guys need a synopsis, just check down below. I'm not gonna read the synopsis. I've been doing that in all the videos, but um, I'm going to leave the synopsis, like the full synopsis down below, as well as links to Goodreads, Amazon, Kindle, Audible, and all that stuff down below. But if you guys don't know, this is biblical fiction, adult biblical fiction that focuses on the story of Esther, the entire book of Esther, which is 10 chapters long. If you have not studied the book of Esther, I do have a playlist already. You can click the eye on the screen for that. We did that maybe a year or two years ago. I will be having an updated uh, study with me with the book of Esther and Ruth coming soon. But um, yeah, so it's biblical fiction and it follows the life of Esther from when she is Hadassah, then renamed Esther, um, in her relationship with King Xerxes, with her uncle Mordecai, and um, things like that. I thoroughly enjoyed this. I gave it five stars. Um, if you haven't seen my reading vlog, check out the reading vlog. You guys can see my full experience. But um, this book was everything and more. I love the faith aspects. I liked that even though we know the book of Esther doesn't have the mention of God, we can see the hand of God at work. And even in this book, she pretty much stuck close enough to for you to really see the hand of God at work but not have his name mentioned and um this was like watching a movie but in novel form and seeing it play out in my mind I did listen to the audiobook as well as when I read this I'm um, sorry guys my brain is like all over the place right now but um this was everything and more the romance in this was phenomenal it wasn't too crazy it was really phenomenal the relationships between the characters was amazing even even the villains there are three main villains in this story, which are Amestris. She is one of the concubines. Um, we have Haman. We know about Haman. Okay. And then Mamukin, Memukin, whatever you call him. Um, I also love that Vashti has a very crucial part in this story. Like you really get to see Vashti and her character and who she is prior to her banishment. And I love that aspect so much. The writing in this was flawless to me it was just written so well the communications between the characters was there i only had one gripe and that was during the time of when hadassah and the other virgins were brought to the palace for that year of beautification there was a major time skip that kind of confused the mess out of me because i was like wait a minute there's no indication that this was a time skip but um that was my only gripe and it was really pretty much fine all i had to do was reread the chat reread that page again and i was fine but um the pacing was great um, the characters were great. The world building was pretty good. It pretty much took place in the palace, so there really wasn't much to the world building, but I did like the descriptions of um, how the rooms looked and everything like that. Um, what else? I was definitely intrigued. I enjoyed the entire book. I think it's a phenomenal read. I definitely would recommend it. And um, I think that's all I want to say. I will leave, like I said, links to my book review down below as well. So you can click down there to go to my blog to see my written review. I didn't want this video to be super long since I have the book look tutorial where I discuss a little bit more about the book. And if you want more um, information, you can just go watch my reading blog. But overall, Star of Persia is just a stunning book. It's a stunning cover. This is my number one favorite story of Esther. So far, I've read two. This one by Joe Eileen Smith as well as Esther by Angela Hunt. Esther by Angela Hunt, I did give four stars too. So I'm glad to now have a five star esther read that i could recommend to people and um i think it is amazing just to see the um the bible come to life period i think jill eileen is phenomenal i did read one other book from her which was the heart of a king you can click the eye on the screen to go to either my book review or my reading blog one of those will be listed in the eye um but i enjoyed her writing in that and gave that book a four star so i was definitely hoping that this was a 4.5 at least um but definitely a five star read definitely recommend it if you're looking for a phenomenal esther story um and especially because it gives xerxes 
more of a heart and you also get to see the internal struggles with him concerning his father which i thought was phenomenal the way she wrote it but overall it's a five star read i love it i recommend it um again the tutorial for this will be coming um maybe in maybe next week after you see this like two videos after you see this video if that makes sense okay so like a week from the time you see this video um the tutorial will be up and i think that's it for this video so i'm going to end it here if you are not if you're not a daughter of increase become a daughter of increase by subscribing to the family or become a son of increase and if you are subscribed click the bell to remain notified when i post new videos or new content or anything like that and i will see you guys in the next one bye